It's only been out for a few months, but the state's new chili plate is a major success, and now it's bringing a national award to the state. News 13's Chris McKee explains. It's different. I wish I could have them. They represent the state a lot. They're new, well-liked, and hard to miss out on the road. But I think the chili like represents the culture here. New Mexico's chili license plate showcasing the state's beloved red and green crop has been embraced by thousands of drivers. New Mexico is all about chili. It's cool. But it's also sparking new national attention. I want to get one now, <laughs> knowing that it's the best license plate out there. The Automobile License Plate Collection Association just named the chili plate 2017's best license plate in the country, calling it stunning and unusual. It beat out top designs from Hawaii, Wyoming, and Oklahoma. The latest win is actually the second for New Mexico. The state won the same award in 2011 for that vibrant turquoise plate that used to run out of stock at the MVD. But now, there's a new favorite. Since July, the state says it's already given out 140,000 of these plates for both cars and motorcycles. You know, chili license plate, green chili, red chili, I love chili too. The red and green chili plate only came to be, though, after Colorado tried to beat New Mexico to the punch by touting its Pueblo chili. New Mexicans say they're glad to see the state came out on top. I think it's good that we're getting known for something. <laughs> Chris McKee, KRQE News 13. If you're getting a plate for the first time, the chili plate is free. Drivers who want to switch plates on an already registered car can do it for as low as $7.25.